We are about to train some glute focused legs, but I'm trying to decide if I should hit quads as well because I'm not going to hit quads until Friday. So I'm sneaking some, sneaking some cheeky quads to start off the week, correct? Even though it's Sunday and it's 6 a.m. I definitely am dressed like it's like 21 degrees outside when it's actually minus five. But we're going to get this session in, try not to catch an illness. That heating is coming on as soon as I get into the car. But, but yeah, I'm going to make sure it's a very good session. I'm going to get these gains because these gains is what we really care about at the end of the day. But yeah, this is an updated glute workout, what I've been doing to train my glutes. Nowadays, I literally do the same movements. Four exercises, max. I just intensify my exercises, make sure that I am going in going heavy no pain no gain progressively overloading the weight each week and yeah enough chatter let's get into business you baby girl we are here <gasps> oh, i'm dreading it i'm dreading it but and i'm gonna feel better in the end i bet i look crazy let's go I need to get my hair done ASAP. I want to get some braids. ASAP Blackie. Because I'm sick. I'm sick of this hair. I'm sick of it already. So guys, I started off with a nice long warm up to get myself as warm as possible because dressing up half naked to the gym in the winter is just not the one. But yeah, I'll just talk you guys through my full glute workout that I have been doing lately that has literally, my results have been insane. But I can't stress this enough in order to build those glutes. You can't only just work out and do these exercises and hope that your glutes will just grow just with working out alone no you have to be eating well alongside make sure you're not skipping any meals high protein meals and yeah that's all it really takes took me a long time to learn that so i'm just giving you guys um the tea should i say And just always make sure you warm up your muscles before going into your session because we do not want any injuries and we want to make the most out of our movements. So by that I mean hitting full range of motion without no soreness or pain from let's say training previous days or just tight muscle, muscle stiffness in general. So that's what warming up. And dynamic stretches help us with but yes I always recommend start kicking off a glute session with some hip thrusts whether you're going to be fair going light or going heavy 
you could just do some supersets with holds or pulses and just drop sets by decreasing the weight and have a minimal rest in between but if you are going heavy make sure your rest periods are as long as possible three to five minutes that's where the real growth be coming but yeah I was just building up heavy doing minimal reps when I went heavy I did like six to eight reps and I only did three sets in total and my ass was on fire Another exercise that I've been loving for glutes is this particular leg press machine. So if you have this in your gym, make sure you utilize it. I definitely prefer my single leg movements, but today I just couldn't be able to take these 50 kgs off each side. So I just did both legs. But yeah, the glute engagement is serious if you slow down the reps. And of course, it wouldn't be a glute session if I am not doing RDLs. And this was my working set. And I think this was like my last set. So my eccentric wasn't as slow as it had been. But I promise you, I have been slowing down my eccentric on, on my RDLs just to feel that engagement hit like crazy. But because this was a struggle set <laughs> so I was just trying to get done and dusted but yeah in the future I'll make sure that I do keep that slow tension in my glutes and this is a new exercise that I have been implementing in my glute sessions lately and it is step ups yep game changer I used to do them all the time I don't know why I stopped so yeah just getting back into it just wait for this end of six weeks this booty is going to be dangerous but yeah give this workout a try and let me know what you guys think like comment subscribe Mwah. for my card all this time I don't even need it but um yeah it was a relatively good workout I'm not I cannot complain because I'm happy with that one I feel like it's one of those things like when you actually show up and just do your best you can't be mad at yourself but yeah Oh, I look like a mess. Like my skin is actually looking awful as well. But like, who cares? Like I've I've been literally sticking to my skincare routine every day. I have seen like improvements, massive improvements. But like, it's still really bad. But yeah, we're getting there though. We're getting there. I feel like. It like I can't complain, it's all a work in progress. I just need to be patient. That's what my friend keeps telling me. Patience, patience, Chevelle, patience. It's not gonna happen overnight. But it's been like over a month now. And I'm still trying to be patient. Always these motorcycles getting in my way. But yeah, bye.